I'm not gonna drag this out. In fact, I'm gonna get right to the point. The Savage Weight Fred Yehi is not for the culture. And I'm gonna explain to you why. Over the course of this past year, of the last year rather, I've learned to multiply by subtracting. Once upon a time, I really believed that just by mere grinding and, and striving to become my best and maintaining positive relationships, having a social media, having a bit of a presence. I, but basically, I tried to check off every single box on this, on this list, thinking that this would guarantee success. However, that wasn't the case. So I had to subtract. And it's so funny that once I did that, promoters whom I've never worked for begin to hit me up. And now I find myself in a match with you, with you, ACH, with you. An opponent who, who your resume is freaking phenomenal. You've been everywhere. An opponent of your caliber I haven't been able to grace the squared circle with in quite some time. And honestly, there are a bit of nerves, there are a bit of jitters, I'm not gonna lie. I can be transparent. I'm aware that when I step in the ring with you, ACH, I have to wrestle up. I have to step my game up to compete with you to avoid being swallowed up. That's how great you are. ACH. I'm like that inmate who is doing time simply because he refused to snitch. Now all of my homeboys are out there having a really good time. They're experiencing life. They're meeting women and they're making a bunch of money, but they can't even simply reply to my letters. Why? Because I refuse to snitch. That's gonna be my culture. ACH, there's gonna be no fist bumping. You're gonna experience the grizzly trade. I'm gonna try to beat your ass. I'm gonna try to break you. I'm gonna subject you to perpetual discomfort, courtesy, savage weight, Fred, yay high. Sometimes you have to multiply by subtracting. I'm gonna do my darnness to subtract and eliminate you. I'm gonna do it for my culture. <laughs>